Hi everyone, this is Adrian from Black Maracas. Today we're meeting with Xtia, so I'm gonna show her one of my favorite places of Madrid. Let's fucking go. Hi everyone, my name is XT. I'm a singer, songwriter, producer from Hong Kong. So now I have my friend Black Maracas to show me around his city of birth, Madrid, and let's go. Your water's falling down, watching you cascade. Listen, nice to meet you, actually. To meet you. I, I did you arrive today? Yeah, there just like a few hours ago. Yeah. Let me know when you come to Hong Kong. Yeah, Show yeah. you around. And do, do you face getting like um, to tourists is difficult? The Hong same. Kong because it's like very small. So uh -huh. if you come to Hong Kong, there's only like you have just one spot, like one one spot you can perform because like it's just in the south and you can just. By train, you go into uh, different areas in different cities in England. It's, it's, I think it's, it's good. So, do you grow up here? Yeah, I grew up in Madrid. I was born and raised here. Oh. Yeah, and I love Madrid. It's actually one of my favorite cities in the world. Food and vibe is amazing. Mm. They have a great music scene, actually, you know. And, uh, So how do you start doing music in Madrid? I actually started like, playing my own music on piano like years ago, mm -hmm. but then I started meeting this kind of music I never had like taste on or like knew about, and yeah. I was like, oh shit, this I like it. This music represents me more, more than the shit I, I listen to in the radio. It's kind of a, a journey. For me, it's like, I think Hong Kong is an interesting place for music because we have our, like, in the 80s, in the 70s, we have established a sound called Hong Kong pop. So in Asia families, every kid has to learn an instrument. Oh, that's For, nice actually, yeah. I don't really into classical music. I just like play it because my mom had, like forced me to do it. Okay. But when I grow older, I feel that like I'm kind of grateful that I learned piano because it helped me. And now I play pop, pop piano and just like it helps so much with my songwriting and to communicate with other musicians. So Now I want to play a lot of shit on piano and, yes, and like, the organ. And I like, dude, I should have made more yeah, effort exactly, when I was young. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. I said, I want to produce exactly. as well. Exactly. I, I produced with the keyboard as well. And I was like, oh my god, I should have practiced more. Yeah, yeah. I should have done it. I yeah. should have done it. Yeah. We also have a big venue in Hong Kong. If you sold out there, it's like you're the top mainstream pop star. Oh, nice. Yeah. Yeah, if you're from Madrid and you do a sold out in every year, it's like, oh, yeah. fuck you, maybe, you know, and this is your old TV. Yeah. Nice. In Hong Kong, the, the, the music venue is mostly like stadium, like big uh -huh. stadium, small stadium. And then if like an indie scene, that we have like underground scene, like pubs, restaurants, and where we are going later in this neighborhood is full of these little menu shows, you know. Mm -hmm. mm, I was running and I was scared. Tell me about how is the like producing process with you and other artists. Did you mm. look for them? They reach to you or what's the uh, for me I like to produce my own sound. So mm -hmm. when I produce for like no matter it's for my own artist project or for other artists. I like to use a lot of organic samples. Mm -hmm. So I sometimes I, I like to get inspiration from the nature and then incorporate into my art. So a lot okay. of water sound. Oh, so nice. I just record different water babbling sound, raining sound to incorporate into making the hi-hat. And also I'm lucky because there's not a lot of female producer in Hong Kong as well. So Yeah, yeah because this is something that I do too, like looking for a producer not just because he's famous or something, just because yeah. The, the way you're treating the sound is more appropriate for me. It's difficult for, to communicate sometimes for me what the sound I want. I don't have the language to tell. It's, it's like, hard, it's hard. I want more dirty, I want more watery sound. It's important not to say no to an artist, right? Like if they want to try something like, no, yeah. I know more than you that it's not gonna sound yeah, good. Just... Let them try. Oh, 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 take care of my... Well, thanks for showing me around Madrid. It's my first time here. It's like, it's wonderful. Thank you. It was great to show you around a bit of the city. I hope you like it. Yeah. yeah. Let's go and have some drinks now. Let's go. Let's go.